Welcome to another exciting episode of our YouTube series. Today, we delve into the enchanting world of The Sound of Music. Join me as we take a trip back to 1965 and explore the captivating story of a young novice sent to Austria as a governess to seven children. In this timeless musical, we witness the journey of love, music, and family. And now, get ready to witness the incredible transformations of The Sound of Music cast, then and now. Julia Elizabeth Wells, born on October 1, 1935, is best known for her role as Maria in The Sound of Music, 1965. As of 2023, she is 87 years old. Andrew started her career at a young age, performing in music halls throughout her childhood and teens. She made her Broadway debut in 1954 and went on to become a star. Julie Andrews is still alive and has made significant contributions to the entertainment industry beyond her iconic role in The Sound of Music. Christopher Plummer, born on December 13, 1929, is best known for his role as Captain George Von Trapp. He portrayed the character in the iconic film The Sound of Music in 1965. Plummer had a successful career, delivering outstanding performances in various roles such as Sherlock Holmes in Murder by Decree, 1979, The Chilling Villain in The Silent Partner, 1978, and The Empathetic Psychiatrist in A Beautiful Mind, 2001. He also received recognition for his role as Leo Tolstoy in The Last Station, 2009. Unfortunately, Christopher Plummer passed away on February 5, 2021, at the age of 91. Eleanor Jean Parker, born on June 26, 1922, is best known for her role as the Baroness. She began her acting career at a young age, performing in school plays and attending the Rice Summer Theatre on Martha's Vineyard. In 2023, Eleanor Parker would have been 101 years old. Despite her passing in December 2013, Parker's legacy as an actress continues to live on through her memorable performances on screen. George Richard Hayden, known professionally as Richard Hayden, was born on March 10, 1905. He is best known for his role as Max Detweiler in The Sound of Music, 1965. Hayden had a distinctive nasal delivery and fussy manner, which contributed to his memorable performances. Unfortunately, he passed away on April 25, 1985. Throughout his career, Hayden had a diverse range of experiences, including selling tickets at a theater, performing in musical reviews, and overseeing a banana plantation. His contributions to the entertainment industry are still remembered today. And there you have it, our glimpse back into the heart-pounding world of The Sound of Music, 1965. Thanks for joining in on this nostalgic adventure. Don't miss out on more classic film discussions. Hit that like button, subscribe and share your thoughts below. Until next time, stay tuned and stay cinematic.